Hi there and welcome, I'm The Technician Project and today's tutorial is going to show you how to create a designated background and animate the pictures within it within Microsoft PowerPoint. So we're going to start our tutorial off today on our desktop. We're going to go to our applications folder and load PowerPoint. Once PowerPoint is loaded, it's going to ask you to select a theme. We're going to create a blank presentation today. And a new blank presentation has popped up. Now, on the right hand side of our presentation, it says some design ideas. We're just going to select one of these ideas. There we go. So, we're going to click on the left hand side now underneath our first slide. We're just going to double click and then press enter and when you press enter you create a new slide within your powerpoint there you go this is the basic standard side we're going to insert an image by clicking on on the insert image picture within our slide and select my my front card of my youtube channel and then on the right hand side you have some more design ideas so we're going to set it to our background uh, with some text over the top of it, just as a different background. We're going to then press enter again on our slides on the left, and we're going to insert two pictures this time. And click on the first one, just resize it, and then we're going to go to our finder, and we're just going to drag in another picture from our documents. just into there, you see? So I'm just gonna rescale that, just a little bit smaller. And I'm gonna click on the first design idea because then both the pictures are in line and there's some text at the bottom of it like a title screen. So if I click on the picture now, my first picture, and in the toolbar at the top it says animate. We're gonna click on the first picture and click appear. And then as you can see, the animation bar turns up on the right hand side and this shows you the first picture is going to animate and the second picture will animate afterwards. So within these animations you have all the editing settings, the timing settings and the trigger settings, etc. So we're not going to change anything today, we're just going to leave it as, as is. We're going to go back to our first slide and we're going to click play slide. So we're going to run through our PowerPoint now. And as I click the keyboard, both these pictures will then appear on a certain either mouse click or keyboard click. If you enjoyed the video today, please leave a like rating and subscribe for more. Thank you for watching and see you next time.